Hi everyone, my name is Rodrigo and you're watching Travelzilla and today I'm going to show you how to get to Lisbon City Center from Lisbon's International Airport by subway. But before we go anywhere, don't forget to drop a like, leave a comment, share and subscribe and also to follow me on Instagram at Rodrigo Morato with two T's, link in description. So are you ready? Welcome to Lisbon. So I'm gonna show you little bits and pieces from several times I went through Lisbon's airport, okay? Coming from various locations. So the first thing you do when you get to uh, Lisbon is that you, if you're coming from outside Europe, you have to go through immigration, okay? And after you pass immigration, you're actually gonna walk through departures, you know? It may seem a bit confusing because many modern uh, airports don't have that, but in Lisbon, that's what happens, okay? You're gonna have to go through departures as you arrive. So immigration, then you go through departures and then you're gonna follow the signs um, to the baggage claim area. After you go through this little door that I'm gonna show you right now, you're gonna have a little screen to your left. So as soon as you get out of that door, um, there is a screen to your left side, actually two screens to the left side, and that's where your belt is informed. So. And that screen right before the baggage carousels will tell you which baggage carousel pertains to your flight. And then you're gonna go through um, customs. So after you go through customs, you're gonna get out and make a right. Okay, make a sharp right and then, and then from there follow the signs to the subway station. So once you go past customs, you're gonna end up in this area. You're gonna make a sharp right, as I told you, and then walk for about a minute or two. You're gonna get to this big atrium here, and all you're gonna do is then make a sharp left, follow the signs to the metro system or subway. You know, keep walking slowly and straight. I know you're probably gonna be tired by now. You just got here from some foreign country far away. Go straight. You're gonna exit the airport terminal. You're gonna see there's a cafe. Keep on walking straight ahead, just for another two or three minutes. And then you're gonna end up at the escalators. Go all the way down, and then you're gonna see a bunch of machines. And then you can buy your tickets right there. The machines will be to your left side. Stay tuned, and then I'm gonna teach you how you can purchase your metro card from the machine in no time. So first thing you're gonna look at is the screen here. You're gonna choose your language, English, okay? So um, then it's gonna give you several options with reloadable card, without reloadable card. Usually it's without reloadable card. So here you have it. It's gonna cost you 50 cents, all right? So 50 cents. And then you're gonna choose for one person or more. And then continue, you're gonna press continue. And then you're gonna select stored value, okay? Which will give you a credit on your um, card, stored value. Then you pick the value that you wanna put on your card. Let's say 10 euros, okay? So 10 euros, how are you gonna pay for it? Cash or bank card? Um, let's say bank card, okay? And then all you're gonna do is insert your credit card or debit card right here, or simply place it right there. And then this card, Viva Viaging, is going to come out down here. That's pretty much it, okay? Cheers. And also, if you have touchless in your credit card or debit card, all you have to do is just touch your card at the touchless sign, and then the amount will be discounted from your card, credit or debit, okay? Of course, you can also pay by cash. So the good thing about the red line, which is the line that connects the airport to the rest of the city, is that the red line connects 
to all other subway lines that exist in the Lisbon subway system. For example, if you need the green line to get to an area such as Chiado, for example, or to get to uh, Cais do Sodré uh, train station, which will connect you to uh, cities in the metropolitan area of Lisbon, all you have to do is take the red line all the way to the Alameda metro station and then from there change to the green line. If you need the yellow line, stay on the red line until Saldanha station and then from there, you know, you can change to the yellow line. And if you need the blue line, stay all the way to the end to São Sebastião station and from there you can exchange to the blue line. So the red line is really really handy you guys. So now let's go all the way from the beginning once again okay so you're here at the Lisbon International Airport. So the red line will connect to all major lines here of the subway system. Lines are green, yellow and blue okay so from the airport you can go to the Oriente train station and at Oriente you can take trains to cities like Coimbra, Porto or to the Algarve in the south of Portugal so on and so forth so you can also take buses to uh, you know other parts of the country so here at Oriente train station you can hop on a train and get to the most important cities here in Portugal and there's also an adjacent bus station and from here you can get virtually anywhere in the country and also you can get to countries like Spain for example. If you don't need the Oriente and you're staying in Lisbon, all you have to do is like just stay on the red line all the way to Alameda. At Alameda you can uh, exchange you can change to the green light so at Alameda you can change to the green line okay and the green line take you will take you to famous places like Chiado, Rocio you know and Alvalade for example all right so that's the green line so if you need the green line take the red line all the way to Alameda and then change to the green line if you need to cross the river onto Almada all you have to do is go from the airport all the way to Alameda and then change to the green line and then once you get to the green line you go all the way to Cais do Sodré and then from Cais do Sodré you can take the boats to the other side of the river or take the trains to many famous cities here in the greater Lisbon area um, you can go to the neighborhood of Belém in Lisbon or you can go to places like Cais Cais as well okay From the Kais Kais train station, you can get to some of the most important cities within the metropolitan area of Lisbon, including Kais Kais, Oeiras, where a lot of technology companies are based, and also Carcavelo Beach, and many others. If you don't need the green line, and you need to change to the yellow line, just stay on the train, and then you can change at Saldanha. At Saldanha, you can change to the yellow line, and the yellow line will take you to places like Rato, Marques de Pombal, where there are a lot of hotels, or to the university, for example. All right, if you don't need the green line, all right, so if you don't need the green line nor the yellow line, you need the blue line, just stay all the way to the end of the red line, and then at the end, at the very end, you're gonna get to exchange to the blue line at São Sebastião, or Saint Sebastian, okay? That's pretty much it. Hey guys, thank you so much for staying with me all the way to the end of this video. Don't forget to drop a like, leave a comment, share, and subscribe, and also to follow me on Instagram at Rodrigo Morata with two T's, link in the description. Thank you so much. See you next time. Bye bye, and welcome to Lisbon.